hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in today i'm very excited to film this video because i was planning to show you the products that i recently got for the baby and that i'm most excited about using as you know i have twin boys they're five years old and it was quite a bit of a time ago when i was getting ready to have you know newborn in my house and things like that and since then so many brands came out with such a cool products and items that i you know i just never thought that i'll be able to use them so now that i'm expecting and i'm having a baby pretty soon i got few of the items that i had before and then i tried with the twins and i know that i love those products and i use them so I just want to show you these items that I already had and I want to show you items that I'm having um, I'm going to try for the first time but I heard really good reviews about so yeah if you're interested in seeing this kind of videos then stay tuned so the first thing I want to talk about is this uh, item I'll post it down below I got it on Amazon it was pretty expensive I believe it was about 200 bucks or something so originally it was the pillow for nursing twins you're supposed to um put it around you you're supposed to sit like this and you can have a baby on the both side and you can also use it as a lounger for the baby and it connects like this so right now i don't have a, a nursing chair like a rocking chair so i'm planning to use this on my bed putting this behind my back and using it for breastfeeding if i end up breastfeeding this time around because uh, during my first uh, delivery with the twins, they were born at 34 weeks because I had preeclampsia. It was emergency C-section. So they ended up staying in NICU for a little bit. And that stay in NICU kind of uh, messed up my plans for breastfeeding. I was not able to, like, I even had some classes to, like, make them latch. But it was very difficult. So I ended up just pumping. So um, hopefully it will be different this time around. So the second thing I'm most excited about using is this Docatot. I heard so many good things about it. Um, and I got this with this marble um, cover. It's super cozy, it's super soft. Um, you're not supposed to let the baby sleep in it, uh, but you can have your baby just lounging and it's super soft and comfortable for them. And I got it with this little um, toy holder. I don't know how to call it and i also got another cover in like a black marble so it kind of matches any design of the furniture and the room and things like that and it's removable and it's easy to wash so i'm super excited to use that so the third thing i'm excited of using um is this Graco. i think it's the duet glide something like this i just got it used i think the new one is a little over 100 bucks or 150 i just got one on um you know one of those apps that you use to buy used stuff the lady said her baby didn't like it i know the baby didn't li don't like um horizontal motion like this but i thought that you know if i buy it for 40 bucks i can try it and if my baby doesn't like it i can resell it um what i like about it that you can install the batteries there's some vibration right here and there's some controls over there i just want to show you um also there's a little you know toys right here i'm planning to take this off and wash it because they were storing it in the garage let me plug it in for you okay so i will try to show you um the cool thing is that you can lift it there's like three positions this can go up i think this is the maximum so this is gonna go up and then it can go down and it can go down i think one or two positions so almost horizontally basically so this is how it works you just you know buckle your baby in there and then there's sounds there's a volume buttons there's a sound um like a white noise or no sound and then um it can rock side to side like this there are a few speeds so I think this is the lowest and you can kind of increase the speed with this. So this is the fastest. You just got to give it a moment. So this is, I believe, 
the fastest. And then there's a also a button to go this way. This way I'm not sure I like because it, the motor is kind of loud. Um, but if the baby can, you know. Our kids didn't really like to go this way as much. So we'll see. And then also there is a um, button that can, uh, that can do like both ways. I mainly bought it so it goes side to side to see how the baby like this side. This kind of action. Um, like I said in my previous video, these toys are not going to be here because it's the suffocation hazard along with this um, blankie. It's just for right now for decor, I guess. Um, but here's the next thing I'm most excited about using is this camera right here. This is a Nanit camera and we are using it with like a freestanding leg right here. Um, we can also take off one of the leg and use it against the wall. After my twins were born, I was so terrified of like suffocation during the sleep. So I was getting up so much more just to check if they're breathing, if everything is okay. So this camera, it comes with like a, with a band that you put on the baby or like a swaddle with a certain pattern. And that camera is supposed to notify you if the baby stopped breathing. So it's supposed to give you a little bit of peace of mind. It's a, a little bit of investment. Um, when you buy a camera, you get like one year of um, their app insights where you can see when the baby woke up, how the baby slept and things like that. Um, but then it's a, like a subscription after that year. But I'm very excited about it. I'm planning to get a few swaddles, like a zip-up swaddles um, for the first months. And then later on, I'm going to be using it with the um, band that goes on the baby chest. And another thing that comes with this camera, because I bought like a full monitoring system that comes with the camera, with the band, and also with this sheet. I kind of washed it. I shouldn't have washed it in hot water, I guess. But it comes with this sheet with a pattern on it so using this sheet you can easily measure the baby because this camera um, detects the pattern and it basically when you just lay baby in the crib uh, the camera can basically figure out the height um, the length of the baby which is really cool because babies are so wiggly and it's really hard to measure them sometimes so I'm really excited about that so the next item i want to show you is this hatch uh sound machine um i actually bought it uh for my kids and i ended up really liking it so the cool thing about this uh hatch that you install the app on your phone and you can have like a couple of or several hatch um attached to this app so it's you can use it as a night light and there's different programs that you can set uh, on your phone using like colors and different sounds. Those are programs that I chose. So on the bottom, there's some like you can make it louder or quieter. And again, it's super convenient during the nighttime, like a diaper changes and things like that. So um, I use it with my kids and they love it. So I'm excited to use it with the baby as well. Um, next thing I want to show you things that I got for baby feeding. So this is what I got for the baby, like a, like a feeding station that I set up. I don't know if I'm going to breastfeed or I'm going to formula feed. I feel like at some point it will have to be a formula anyway so i'm prepared either way <laughs> basically this is the baby brezza uh sterilizer and dryer you can either just sterilize or just dry or do both there are settings for like uh, 45 for 30 45 and 60 minutes and i'm sterilizing some like um, breast pump um supplies in there um, also baby Bre Brezza bottle warmer which is also convenient and super easy to use and then I also have this baby Brezza formula maker um, 
with the twins we used to pre-make the bottles so we just had like a, a bunch of bottles available at night and we had like two or three scoops whatever amount of formula they were uh, eating at that point uh pre-made um with the baby brisa formula um i think it's called formula pro advance or something like this you don't have to do it you can just press the button and it pours uh warm water mixed up with the formula for you and here's the bottles that i'm planning to use there are actually two more things i wanted to show you we use them with the twins and we absolutely love them so the first one is this duna stroller it's the stroller that converts into a stroller wait <laughs> <laughs> a stroller that converts into a stroller huh? it's the car seat that converts into a stroller it's that's like pretty a... handy though if you have a stroller <laughs> that converts into a stroller because i mean you have like double stroller you know what <laughs> it, when you're pregnant your brain works different way is that it, what it is it spins different direction yeah okay anyway press is going to do a little demonstration so this is the stroller that converts into stroller um it, it's supposed to have like an infant insert i need to wash it and put it in there so this is a car seat mode and then you put the baby in there and you can pull this out like this and it has wheels attached so with the press of the button the car seat converts into a stroller <laughs> yep it's been we, so long yeah it's been so long it's been like five years already you use it probably for the first year of the baby's life and this thing extends so it's really good if you're short or it's really good if you're taller uh there's i, f I forgot it's been so long yep. i don't remember me either oh wait right here yeah it's right there Oh, yeah, it's right there. Like yeah, yeah, I remember. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the stroller. I absolutely love this Duna. I Wait, absolutely love this Duna. Yep. I don't know. It's not going to fit my car. Nothing, nothing's going to fit my car. So, this is probably going to Preston's car. Yep. Um, so, yeah. And it folds. I forgot how it folds. I forgot how it folds. I guess we got to learn all this stuff. Oh, oh just like that. Nice. Good job, baby. Cool. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> and the last thing I got, um, yeah, we need to we need to take this to your car and try it out if it fits. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Not right now. Not right now. Later. And the last thing is this baby Bjorn. I don't know if it's a swing or it's a bouncer or what it is. There's like no batteries in there or anything. No, it's not a swing. It's a swing. Though. But it's like a bouncer, right? Yeah uh-huh so you put the baby in there it's super cozy this is like a josie fabric uh, and you can there's um different levels you can make it lower or you can make it higher so the baby is sitting there and the baby wiggling and kind of rocking uh herself and this toy was kind of entertaining for the babies so we we'll love them with the with the twins and i'm excited to use it with the baby as well and that is pretty much it for today's video guys thank you so much for tuning in today i really appreciate you watching and supporting my channel please subscribe if you haven't done so yet and please leave me your comments down below i love reading them as well and please give me a thumbs up and preston is putting a little bit of shadow on my face <laughs> and ring the bell yep and until next time, we'll see you guys soon. Bye. <laughs> There's still a bell over No? What is it? I don't know if that's how, you, how uh, they... Oh, get notified? Yeah. I think you're supposed to click on like a notification bell, yeah, just to get notified. But I'm not very familiar. I'm not familiar about the bell. Yeah, Preston knows about the bell. All right. Bye, guys. Yeah.